This is a follow-up to the previous video I did for Mike F. Uh, he now seems to be claiming that the moon is a flat disk and that this somehow solves his problems uh, with geometry. And uh, I'm just going to make this real quick to show that uh, the moon being a flat disk doesn't solve any of his problems. Okay, so I've recreated uh, my previous illustration, except that this time I'm using a flat disk to represent the moon. So if you're on the ground directly below the moon, again at point B, looking straight up at the moon, and it's a flat disk, it's going to look circular, like this. But let's say again that you're on the flat Earth and you're a few thousand way, miles away from Observer B over here at point C. Now you look at the moon from that point and it's no longer a circle. Now it's an oval. Well, Mike F. seems to be arguing that the moon turns to face you. So that, again, it's a circle. And that's fine if the moon constantly turns to face you individually as it rotates around above the Earth's surface, as it revolves. But uh, here's the problem. Okay, let's say you're observer C now and the moon is again facing you because it's rotated its face to point at you. Okay, well, to someone still over at point B, it looks like this. And someone it, the same distance in the opposite direction at point A is going to see that. Yeah, that's uh, not going to work, is it? So, sorry, Mike. Uh, you still don't understand geometry, and your claim doesn't solve any of the problems that uh, I raised.